This is Pete. He's just served six years in prison for committing a violent robbery to fund his drug addiction. Now he's been released on probation and a team of staff will spend the next 24 months helping him rebuild his life to prevent him re-offending. I'm Pete's Offender Manager. I work with Julie, Case Administrator. and We coordinate the case, we arrange for a hostel place and we're helping him to get off drugs. In the next 24 months, a team of probation staff will be making sure that any risks he poses to the community will be properly managed and also give support with training and finding work. In return, Pete will need to keep his appointments and help us to help him. I'm Pete's probation services officer. I work as part of a team at Hostel that includes drugs counsellors, employment workers, night supervisors, cooks and cleaners. I work at the hostel where Pete has to live as part of his licence on leaving prison. While he's here, Pete and I will meet on a regular basis to talk about his offending behaviour. The people living in probation hostels are there because they represent a risk to the community and need help to reintegrate and turn their lives around. So as well as rehabilitation, probation staff play a key role in protecting communities. I'm a victim liaison officer for the probation services. My job is to make sure that the interest in victims of crime are properly represented. When Pete was due to be released from prison, I contacted the victims of Pete's last offence to give them details about his release. My job is to ensure that victims are not forgotten. Every year, thousands of burglaries are committed by people needing money to buy drugs. That's why it's important for us to help as many offenders as possible to stay off drugs. That's great. I'm Pete's specialist drug worker, and it's my job to make sure he stays drug free on his release from prison. If we can do this, Pete will stand a much better chance of keeping out of trouble in future. Probation staff help many ex-offenders find work each year Getting ex-offenders into employment means they become taxpayers and contribute to the wealth of this country. I'm an employment skills advisor and I've been helping Pete find a job by organising skills training sessions for him and helping him prepare for the job interview he's on his way to now. I got into drugs by getting in with the wrong crowd and ended up doing stuff that I'm not proud of to fund my habit. If probation staff hadn't been there to help me turn my life around, I'm pretty certain I would be back on drugs and doing robberies to help me pay for them. Then I would have ended up back in jail. I'm proud of what I've achieved since my release. I've got a steady job, I'm paying taxes, and I'm staying off drugs. But I couldn't have done it on my own. Probation worked for me, and thousands of others like me. It takes a whole team of probation staff to help ex-offenders reform their behaviour and successfully reintegrate back into society. Probation works. To find out more about Unison members working in the probation service, go to unison.org.uk.